welcome back to my channel. Sorry I haven't been around lately. Um, well, it's been like a week or so, hasn't it? I haven't been able to upload because my internet is so, so terrible here and it's a very sore subject that makes me very angry and very upset. So I'm trying to work with what I can. Um, but if you see me in the same outfit, I've bulk filmed videos to upload when I do have good internet. So that's what that's about. But today we're going to do something a little bit different because we are going to actually do a home bargains haul because thanks to people like um, Brummy Remind Me of Two and Sprinkle of Glitter who I've just sort of rediscovered recently and started watching again and they do a lot of this kind of content and I really enjoy it so I thought I would do that and I went to Home Bargains this afternoon it's actually like six o'clock now it's still light which is why I kind of hope the lighting is okay for you but um yeah I thought we could do a little haul because I really enjoy watching these so I thought that you might too if it's something that you don't like then um, you know, let me know and I won't do them anymore, but I do enjoy them, or if you've got any other requests for this type of thing, I will happily do more of them. So I'm going to jump right into it, it is a very random mixture, <laughs> just pre-warning you about that, but that is what that is. Um, so, let's go with like home decor kind of stuff. I picked this up, I think it was like £1.49, it's just this cute little glass jar, and I'm in the process of repainting my dresser white and kind of changing the knobs on it and stuff, and um, I've reorganised my storage so that I've got a bit more storage so that I can actually have more kind of pretty things out on it rather than just functional, and because I've got all my perfumes back here on the fireplace, I don't have to have them on there, so I've got more room, and I wanted this to put my little con, um, but did like Q-tips, because I use them a lot when I'm putting makeup on, because I always end up with mascara <laughs> smudges everywhere. Um, I'm going to put the bag down because I have actually literally just come back and I've got it in a bag. I've got things laid out but, you know, we've not been here very long and I haven't got everything situated just right yet. Um, but I bought these two soap dispensers. They're not the prettiest. They were 99p though each so I don't really care. Um, I have seen nicer ones. I have got nicer ones but um, I'll get around to it. But just at the moment I was hating seeing hand wash. Just, you know, the ugly like Carex packaging. I don't mind the soap, it's just the packaging that I hate. Um, so I picked these ones up. This one is white, this one is grey. And I just thought they were nicer. I'll just dispense the soap into it. This one I think is going to go in um, my downstairs bathroom. And this one is going to go in the shower room. So, yeah, they were 99p. And, you know, like, they're, they're, they're quite nice, I guess. They're okay. Um, then, what else in terms of stuff like that? I also picked this up which I really, really like, and I've seen it in there so, so many times, and every time I look at it, I'm like, I need to buy that, so I bought it. Um, and it is this vase, which kind of, you can see, I'm so glad you can see it on camera, because I wasn't sure if you are going to be able to. It looks like a bubble, doesn't it? Like a giant bubble, and this was 3 99 and I love it. And I bought this bunch of fake peonies. Now, I know some people are snobby about fake flowers. I love having fresh flowers, but I don't have a problem with fake ones, and peonies are one of my faves, and I think these are just so pretty. Um, so yeah, these are going to go in here. I'm going to trim them down a little bit, obviously, um, and kind of have them displayed a little bit more nicely. Maybe I'll get some of those... Um, like stone things that you put in the bottom of this just to hold them in place. I will get some of those actually. But I thought that looked would look really, really pretty on my dresser. Really like that. So yeah, that's one of the things that I got. I'm gonna just pop that down. Um then moving on to very glamorous and elegant things. I got these because they were 99 Um they're domestos, whatever you call them, you put them in your toilet and it makes the water go blue and oh I've actually now thought, what if these make the water go yellow? That's not what you want. Oh, I don't know anyway, but they make it smell good. And the, the toilets we've got here um, are, like the house is a bit older and we've been having plumbing issues because the previous tenant was disgusting and did weird things. And um, yeah, it's a whole issue that I'm not going to do about online, but that's why I got these anyway. So I'm going to put those in there soon. Um, then I've got some of these Lenore Unstoppables. I actually do really like to do these with my washing, but I don't do them very often because A, I think they're expensive, and B, they're really bad for the environment. But what I will be doing with these is I'm going to get some little fabric pouches and put them inside and kind of make my own, um, like, you know, like scent pouch things to put um, in my wardrobe, so my drawers and stuff to make everything smell fresh. So that's what I got this for, and I'm happy to pay it for that. Um, then I've got some Febreze, this is the Fruity Tropics, I use Febreze when I make the bed most days and I use it on our sofas and curtains and that kind of thing just to freshen things up. I do clean obviously as well, very often, but I like to just have everything smelling fresh and this one is Fruity Tropics. I haven't actually smelt this before. Yeah, 
smells nice. It smells, it smells like Febreze, like the regular one actually, to be honest. Um, then let me just get the bag up here. I'm going to make myself a little bit of room and start showing you all of the other goodies that I've got. Well, I say goodies, they're not like that interesting really. Um, I got some Zaflora because I'm addicted to it. I use it to clean quite often and I also always use it with hot water in my sink after I've cleaned and I use it to wash my floors. So I do go through it a lot. And I grabbed two of the um, pink grapefruit version. These are limited edition but they smell really nice, really nice for summer. So I got two of those and then I also got two of the larger bottles of um, citrus fresh and apple orchid um, orchard apple and um, orange are my favorites well the orange one I really like to clean the floor with the apple one I love in hot water because it smells like a sort of sweet delicious perfume or something it's lovely I love that one so I restocked up on those then what else do we have oh these are exciting okay they had refreshers in there I'm not somebody who eats sweets particularly often, um, just because, I don't know, I'd rather eat crisps or chocolate. But these used to be my favourite as a kid, and you never ever see them anywhere anymore. And I, I saw them in there, and I just thought, yeah, I'm going to buy them. Um, so, yeah, I picked up a pack of those. I'm actually going to have one. I'll show you. Maybe those of you who aren't from the UK don't know what these are like. But they, they saw, oh, I, that rubbed against that one, and it really made me go funny. Ugh, made me go all like hairs in my neck set up. Um, they're sort of like fizzy, slightly sour sweets. They sort of taste what you imagine that washing powder tastes like, but in a nice way. Um, yeah, I grabbed those, that was random. I also grabbed one of these, um, the Fry Light sprays. I use this quite often because, not just for the calorie perspective, I can't talk now, I've got it in my mouth. Um, but it's very good for, I like to, most things I'll cook in the oven, I will put tin foil on first because I don't like things to stick. Lining it with this makes them not stick as well, so that's what I use that for. Um, the sweet wasn't so bad in eating this, was it? Wait. Oh, it's dissolving. We'll be okay. Um, what else beauty wise did I get? Oh, I got this coconut oil. This was really affordable. It's probably not the best, but I like to use it kind of as a hair mask type of thing. Not very strong fragrance, um, but yeah, if I use that like on my hair dry before I wash it, I think that'd work quite well. So I'm looking forward to using that. I think that. Um, will do the job that I needed to do. I also got some eye makeup remover because I actually did need some because I usually just use an oil to take up all of my makeup, makeup but I've been using the L'Oreal Paradise Mascara recently and that is a little bit harder to get off so I wanted some and they had my favourite eye makeup remover which is quite hard to get hold of in there um, and it's the Garnier 2-in-1 um, soothing makeup remover. Love this stuff, it's my favourite so I was really happy to have that in my life again. Um, and then, last but not least, what do we have here? Um, I got some bubble bath. Um, this is the eucalypt peppermint and eucalyptus. Well, it's shower gel, but you can use it as bubble bath, can't you? They usually have my favourite one in there, the purple one from Imperial Leather, but they didn't have that one in there today. So I just grabbed this one, but this smells nice and kind of refreshing. So, yeah, um, that is everything. I actually didn't buy as much as I thought I did. Well, I bought things like coal and firewood, but I didn't want to show you that because I figured that was quite boring. Um, but yeah, let me know if you want me to do more of these videos. Do you want me to do like a pound chop one, a B&M one, that kind of thing? I watch other people's videos and they buy so many stuff from there and they buy like snacks and all sorts of things like that. I don't tend to buy that kind of thing um, from places like that just because, I don't know, it just doesn't occur to me. So I, I haven't like bought things like that, um, but... If you want me to do more um, stuff like that, then let me know. Happily, I'll do a B&M one. I do like a good mooch run b &M, if I'm being honest. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. <laughs> let me know what bargains you picked up recently as well. And I'll see you all soon. Bye.